New video shows the beginning of a violent and deadly crime spree. It started when a man wasn't allowed to buy a gun at an Academy sports store in Liberty. For the first time, we can show you what happened. KCTV5's Emily Rittman got a copy of the surveillance video inside that store. We first requested this video in February after a Clay County deputy shot and killed a suspect. Investigators waited to release the video until after the prosecutor's office could review the case. They determined the deputy's actions were lawful and necessary to protect the public and other officers. This is the moment customers knew something was wrong inside the Academy Sports and Outdoors in Liberty. They ran out the front door. Around 11 a.m. January 2nd, investigators say 26-year-old Jeffrey Dale Millsap pulled into the parking lot and walked inside. The store surveillance showed Millsap wore a black jacket as he browsed the ammunition section while other customers looked on. Millsap then approached the gun counter and filled out the proper paperwork to buy a gun. He gave an employee his photo ID. According to court records, Millsap did not pass the background check to buy a gun. Those records don't explain why. After being denied, surveillance cameras show Millsap pulled out a knife and jumped the counter. He jumped back over the counter and appears to drop the stolen gun. He also stole ammunition before running down the aisle with a knife still in his hand. As he ran through the store, he passed by concerned customers. Investigators say Millsap drove from Liberty to the landmark Dodge Chrysler Jeep dealership off Nolan Road in Independence, Missouri, where he shot employee Jody Hendrick. KCTV 5 News spoke with Hendrick last week. He says he is still recovering after Millsap shot him seven times. All I could think about uh, when it started and when it was over was, you know, I'm not going to see my family again. White male, approximately five, eight or six foot wearing all black. After shooting Hendrick, investigators say Millsap refused to pull over for officers who tried to stop him. He instead drove to his home off Northeast 172nd Street in Holt, Missouri. That's where investigators say Millsap refused to show his hands and pointed a gun at the deputy who shot him. Prosecutors determined the deputy acted in lawful self-defense. Emily Rittman, KCTV5 News.